Amaterasu. I don't think I'm gonna be able to keep, you know, keep doing this. It's, whew, it's tough. I understand that it's tough, but you must stay focused. After all, there are plenty of men after you now that you have the Lich's armor. Uh, yeah, I guess you're... Son of a... Uh, fine. Come on. Destruction! <laughs> My new power! You may not have died to that, but I got something else for you. Summoning Art's Dark Blade Technique! You will not escape me. I guess what's one more of these guys, huh? Oh well. Come on, awaken. Uh, that means some of you guys must still be alive. Somehow. Oh well. So what's next on Matarasu? There is rumors of an Uchiha. No. I send something else. It's a Senju. There is a Senju here in the land of Skyrim. She's... Wait a minute. I can feel Hyuga. Yes, she has the Hyuga bloodline as well. It's remarkable. So she's a Senju, and she has the Hyuga bloodline. This I gotta see. This I definitely gotta see. Do you have, uh, do you have any way to get there? Um, senior. Let's see. Maybe he. Ah, there we go. The little sister. Uh, let's see what we got. What's this? Hello, Dragonborn. My subordinates, if I keep an eye on you. Um, for a while, you're amazing. It is for this reason that I have a request for you. I have received word that my baby sister has come to Skyrim in search of our sister, Ophelia. She doesn't know what she's getting herself into. Please, Dragonborn, I beg of you. Take Raiko under your wing. I don't want to lose another family member this soon. Our sister isn't what she used to be. She would tear my poor Raiko to shreds and think nothing of it. She currently lives in a shack northwest of Falkreath. She's still studying this language, so please be mindful of this. There's a safe behind the shack hidden by two small trees. The key to it is on top of the note. Inside is a little something for your troubles. Take it as a token of my appreciation. The key also opens the door to Raiko's shack. Use it. Neji. Who's Neji? You have never heard of Neji? The great Hyuga? The one born into servitude. <laughs> A branch family, instead of being the main branch. Well, let's just say his power is that of the main branch, even though he's not in it. Uh, okay, I mean, I, I guess. I've never really heard of him. Uh, although I really don't remember much anyways, so, I mean, I guess uh, i got to take your word on that one. So, let's see here. It should be labeled on the map somewhere. Aha! Here we go. Uh, well, here we are. Let's see here. Sit behind the shack. Oh, there it is. Uh, we'll take the key and the note. Thank you. Wait, why didn't he just save her? That doesn't make any sense. I mean, he obviously put the key and the note here. <sighs> well. Guess I'm coming in. Oh, did you need something? It's a fine day with you around. Reiko? Who are you? And what do you want? How do you know my name? Dad voice acting, though. <clears throat> At ease. I do not wish to fight you. I just want to talk. I'm sorry. I've been on edge since coming here. 
The moment I got off the boat, bands have tried to rob me. I see. Well, since you're not a bandit, just who are you? I am Yoroma Uchiha. It's a pleasure to meet you, I suppose. So, you come here alone? But you're so young. Aren't you afraid, Raiko? To be honest, yes. I didn't expect Skyrim to be like this. But I'm a strong girl. I'll get through this. Why not just go back home? I cannot. Not until I find out why my sister... Until you find out why she what? Nothing. I shouldn't concern others with my problems. It's okay. Neji asked me to help you. You don't have to be alone here anymore. I... You must be the one he mentioned in the letter he sent me. I'm ashamed I didn't notice sooner. Thank you. My pleasure, Raiko. Well then, shall we move along? Yes, partner. Do you notice anything strange about her? Like what? What what are you what are you seeing? Look at her eyes. Look deep into her eyes. She's a Huga, a Senju. But she also has the Mongekyo shotting gun. What? How is this possible? Still here. Um Let's get going then. Raiko's diary. Second day of Morningstar, dear diary, how could she? My own sister. Father, I'm sorry I could have saved you if I had have known. Dear diary, I can feel my sister's chakra even though she's so far away. I'm going to board a ship that is headed towards her location tomorrow, although her chakra is changing. It feels darker. This is not the loving Ophelia that I grew up with. I'm finally here. The locals call this place Skyrim. What is a strange... Oh, what a strange place. Is it always so cold? I should have brought a coat. My ship boarded in a city known as Solitude. You call this stuff money? It seems that my money is no good in this land. I'll have to earn some somehow. I managed to find work as a maid in the Winking Skeever. I've raised nearly 2,000 septums. It's not much, but it should be enough to get me on my way. Today's my birthday. I'm now 18. I wish father were alive to see. I feel so lonely, at least Kura Ku Kurama? What? what? Ho ho Kurama? This doesn't make any sense. Kurama's in you. I saw the chakra activate within you. Y you Kurama is in you. What is she talking about? I don't know. Maybe a jutsu that may have split Kurama in two? I don't know. Even if he's nothing more than a body embodiment of hate, I wonder if my ancestor Naruto got along with Kurama's father. Someone left me a bottle of mead and a single nightshade in my hotel room. It's so pretty. How did they know it was my birthday? Strange, there was also a note. It read, You will find what you seek in Falkreath. Life's greatest illusion is innocence. Perhaps I should travel there. Well, off I go. I'm leaving for a place named Falkreath. I hope it doesn't take too long to get there. The local blacksmith was nice enough to forge me a set of armor before my journey. He said that it was... At the request of a red-haired woman, I don't know anyone like that. Weird. I've made it to Falkreath. It's not as cold as it uh, here as it is in Solitude. I still wear my maid's clothing, though. I don't want to seem out of place just yet. Since I'm here, I should get to know the area. I saw a strange glowing pond in the distance. I sense great evil coming out of that pond, Kurama said. I couldn't feel it. I think Kurama is just being paranoid. I see a strange door with a big red hand on it. Perhaps this is what the letter was referring to? I knocked. What is life's greatest illusion? The door said in a burly voice. Without even thinking, I said, Innocence, my brother. The door swung open and I walked in. Uh, who is this milk drinker? Who are you calling a milk drinker, you old hag? I snarled. Hag? I like you. I'm Astrid. The weird redhead said, A melon-headed teenager with strange eyes would come to us someday and definitely fit the description. Tell me, what is your name, child? Raiko. Raiko Senju. Ah, yes, the Senju clan. You know of my people, but we originated so far away. The red haired, the redhead told us all about your clan. Where's this redhead? I have no idea. Raiko, she lies a long ass book. Um, Dark Brotherhood, here is your amulet. Wait a minute. What? I can feel it. You haven't killed a single person. Well, no, I haven't killed anyone, nor do I want to, except maybe her. We can help you do that. 
But until you kill someone, we will not become a full member. <sighs> Dark pawn until blood is stained your blade. You may keep the amulet. It is said to draw victims. I'll do anything to avenge him. The giant door slams shut. Sweet mother of the first, that pawn spat out two identical swords. Where the first sword landed, there's ice. That's a strange... What's this strange book? No matter, I'm keeping the book and no... One of the swords, no need to be greedy. I shall wait here until some poor, poor bastard arrives. I hope they're at least old and frail. <laughs> oh my god, dude, how long is this? You guys can read this at your own leisure. You guys go and pause this and everything, but I'm just like... No, this is way too much here. Alright, hang on. Okay, so let's go ahead and... Whoa! <clears throat> um... Hello? Uh, <clears throat> what do you think you're doing? We're trying to stop your father's infinite Tsukiyomi. We're not here to have a, a fun time. We're not here to help your manly ways go about. Stop being so perverted and get on with it. Sheesh, alright, alright, I got you. I'm sorry. Uh, let's see, for Raiko. Uh, Bilishak. Sad me. Okay. There's nothing in the drawers. Just an interesting blade. Okay. Out to Skyrim. Whoa, what the? Where are... Why is my... Why is Kurama's chakra activating? Where, where are we? If I had to guess, I would say this is within Raiko. The gate holding Kurama captive. I've never seen anything like this in my life. What's this? Uh, no one saw that. It was very dark, so no one saw that. <clears throat> There's someone over there. There's so many chambers to this area. Must be Kurama. Uh, my chakra's been taken. Uh, uh, Kurama. Just pretend he's in the cage. I can't do nothing about this. Take Kurama's power? What what are you thinking, Amaterasu? You idiot! That's not me, that's your father talking to you through the infinite Tsukiyomi. He wants you to claim her life so you can gain power. So he can control you. I I don't I don't know who to believe. It should I should I kill her? Is that why she was even put into this world? So I can slay her? Yes, do it. This is how all Uchiha gain her power. The Mongekyo Sharingan. The eternal Mongekyo Sharingan. Kill her, steal Kurama's chakra, and steal her eyes. Don't listen to him. If you do this, you'll just be falling right into his hands. Don't you understand what he's doing to you? He's using you! Who are you going to believe? A little puppy? Or your own father? I, I don't know. Who should I believe? 